for uh, the quick kills because they Peach and Yoshi are good floaties, but they are they can survive for very long. Nice freeze will actually just get hit legit. Peach won't get too much mileage off that. Oh, goes for the down air. This is a dangerous situation as he has lost that invisibility. Nice stuff for both pairs. They really complement each other. Yoshi on the side with the up knees and Peach just in there doing whatever he needs to. No stitch, but we'll be able to get a fat combo off of that. Hits off legit onto the side. Ooh, played for the, well, I don't know if he wanted the suicide, but he, oh! Four, four side Bs and a down smash. We'll take off the Yoshi. Good stuff from legit. I see why he chose the Ganon for this one. Once that dead and gone. Nice. Ooh, able to get the down air, but won't be able to converge off anything from a Big D onto Legit. Staying on the side, I think he's looking for the side B suicide as he is up a high percentage and he needs that. Or it would be beneficial for him to get a kill. Oh, back air will be able to hit him out, actually. I don't know who actually side B, so I don't know if that was a good thing or a bad thing. I think he had actually Lucas, but regardless, he could go on stage. See, that's the thing about Ganondorf. Yes, he can hit hard and still has that good side B. Just coming in clutch. Good edge guard from Big D. Capitalizing on Ganondorf's uh, recovery. We'll be going to hit him off. Up smash holds that. Up smash. Legit forward smash of Ganon. We'll be able to get Big D off. Oh, and he goes for he actually SDs. I'm not sure what happens there, but he goes for SDs. Uh, tells him to take the stock, actually. So we're actually, this might be in a bad, this uh, team, Vertigon and Legit are in a bad situation. Both of them, Lucas, at one stock. But he, the Ganondorf is doing a lot. Abel almost, almost got the shield off. Oh, forward smash was there. Was going to get the Lucas, but uh, Lucas is able to narrow out of there. Holding that forward smash actually has a huge range, so the punishment isn't that able to come out. Nice, gets a shield poke from there. Won't be able to get out as Big D is there to cover him, so only a dash attack will be coming into play. Nice down air from uh, Vertigon. Does not get a spike. Freeze goes all the way out. Good mashing from him. Will be a patient out. Is it really? This brought it back. This is totally winnable. They are building up percentages. Lucas is there, and oh, commentator's curse. Just as I said that, he is down. Nice up air, we'll be able to get him up. Ooh. Oh, that hits like a truck again. Good side B, we'll be able to capitalize on it, however. Yoshi coming straight down from invincibility and gets the down smash. Getting with Ganondorf off the edge. Big D and Firefly take it 1-0. Yeah, sure. Anyways. Guys know each other a lot. Guys played each other a lot, so they know each other's play styles and everything. Day. Melee singles have actually started, so I believe um, when we are done with doubles, we will merely be streaming uh, Melee singles, and then the 4 o'clock will be our ultimate singles for today. Looking like we're having a lot of a lot of people, actually. We have 28 signed up, and there's still two hours left in the venue or, until, it, or until the journey starts. Alrighty, back to winner's finals. What will Legit choose? That is the question. It looks like Vertigon wants to stay on that Lucas. And I'm saying that's my problem. We'll go into Diddy, actually. I'm liking the changes on these. Mix them up. Perfect. Are they actually choose the... Ooh. Oh, yeah. This we are, we are using the Genesis rule set. So I believe this is... Oh, Pokemon 
stadium? I, yeah, I believe so. It's quite nice because we do. <laughs> it's I actually quite like it now because you do get more variation and you don't. The next partner, if you don't like Castle Jesus, gets wasted the one one on Castle Jesus. They have two bands actually now, but more bigger and better stages for doubles. Nice spike from Yoshi. Can he recover from that? Oh, gets hit by the tip of the recovery. Won't be to get much on that. Another day for uh, Vertigon. Underestimate the recovery, and you will die to it. I'm not sure what they're trying to go for. Maybe they're just trying to go for a solid neutral play. Uh, not very knowledgeable in the matchup, so. But again, I mean, I believe the Jits main was actually going to be fun. Probably just a comfort pick at the moment. Again, not 100% sure. Oh. A down, I think it was a down smash from Yoshi. Will be to take out Lucas. Try to recover. Oh, Yoshi trying to cover for uh, Big D, but actually will edge guard him instead. Don't be surprised by uh, Yoshi's recovery. He's actually good, really good. Super armor is there. Up he gives him a bit of mileage as well. Nice there from Legit. We'll take out the Yoshi. Both, everyone's at an even stock. Two to two at the moment. Legit is coming up to a dangerous percentage. Half 92. Almost at kill range right over there. Oh, we have a Shaman. Is it Shaman? Shaman in the back? Shaman? Shaman? Shaman. I forgot which Pokemon that is. Regardless, Big D trying to go for the edge guard. Uh, won't be able to get anything from that. Actually, good stuff from the uh, Legit and Vertigon trying to cover each other up. Same goes to Blitz Dynasty. They were covering for each other's vulnerabilities over there. So Big D, if that was a turn, if plays with the turn up a bit, if only that was a stitch face. Ooh, red team is both at the edge. Gets the side B to recovery. Snaps the legend, gets that hit. Up B won't be able, will hit him, but he I believe gets hit by something. I'm not quite sure. I didn't see that. Big D is dead. Will be able to die from there. Oh, Yoshi is going low for that, but again, it is the earthbound character. This character go far. Back here. Strong backer will take Yoshi out. And again, right after they take out the legit. Oh, is he camp? Where is he at? <laughs> Diddy Kong staying there. <gasps> actually gets Big D. Big D will actually SD from that side. That was amazing. That's 1000 IQ. Yo. I didn't even know where legit was. I thought legit died. He's actually hanging on the bottom of the stage. Big D trying to capitalize on that, but wasn't able to. I don't know if he got gimped or he just SD'd, but he does lose his stock. Does this. this this does spell disaster for Red Team as it's only down to Yoshi left. However, Legit is at a very, very uh, dangerous percentage. That's why you see him being on the offside over there. Lucas is going to be the uh, in person. Again, if Firefly can get Legit, which is just what he does, it's going to be an even match. It's going to be Firefly's Yoshi against uh, Vertigon's Lucas. See what it can do up. Playing a very patient game as they're just playing for each other's projectiles to wait or out. Nice combo from Firefly. We'll be able to rack up a percentage up there from both down it. Oh, Yoshi hits hard. A spike from Yoshi comes into play. Will he be able to recover? Yes, he will. Lucas's uh, recovery is pretty far. That was a good spike, but not able to do it. Again, it's still anyone's game. Here you go, boss. Anyways, again, very patient. But it looks like Firefly is in the commanding seat as he gave you a get some percent off. Nice, neutral B. Tries to set up for the, uh, tries to go for a setup, but won't be able to get anything from there. Back air will send the Yoshi flying. It is a strong back air. Super armor will be in play. Uh, gets hit by the up B. Let's take by the PK Thunder, which just gets a little bit dinked there. Very patient from both of them. Both knowing that uh, Goon's Dynasty is actually on the edge. Oh, up smash tried to come out, tried to go for a hard read, but won't be able to do it. The bat actually reflects the Yoshi ball. Both playing very back air, gets it, and Glyce Dynasty 
Good one from Firefly, able to pick it back up and 1v2, get the situation and take it 2-0. They are now proceeding on to...